Lee, welcome to Wrexham. Uh, how excited are you, first and foremost, to be here? Really excited. Um, obviously been out of the game a little while. Uh, thought the opportunities to, to get back and play would be few and far between. Um, obviously, the unfortunate nature of me being here for Rob is not ideal, but um, hopefully I can I can come in and contribute to him now at the end of the season. And, yeah, it's with everything that's going on at the club and the hype and the position they are in the league, it's uh, it's a nice challenge to, to be involved in. Yeah, you mentioned it there, what you can contribute. You've got some promotions under your belt. Um, just, you know, is it that experience, is that the main thing you, you'd like to bring to, to help the others and, and to contribute to something special, as we were saying just then? Yeah, I think so. I think, obviously, the nature of my age and how long I've been around, I'll bring the experience. Um, People want to lean on me and ask things. You can. It's obviously when you've been in these positions before. It's um, you can kind of navigate the waters a bit better than, than people who haven't. But no, I think uh, if I can add something to the group and add some value, that'll be that'll be great. I know you watched the game uh, on Tuesday night against Halifax Town. Just how impressed are you with with this squad and with the fans as well? Well, the passion's there. You can see with the fans. It's um, the noise was was clear to, to hear through the telly. Uh, I think obviously when the team doing well and, and winning makes a big difference. And I say the hype that goes around the, the place with everything with the owners and, and whatnot, obviously makes for a special time, but the team's on a good run. They've also got aspirations to get promoted um, and some good fixtures ahead. So fingers crossed the team continue doing and, and be a part of something special towards the end of the year. Yeah, and what does this mean to you personally at this stage of your career as well? Um, well, it's exciting. It's obviously since finishing last, the end of last season, there's been opportunities to get back in, but nothing that's really, really took my fancy, to be honest with you. And I think um, you get to a stage in your, your career where you can sort of plod along. And I've never really been, been that sort of person. I've always wanted to be involved in stuff and try to add value and contribute um, and to be a part of something. And luckily, as I said, obviously the misfortunes of Rob is, is why I'm here, but um, to come to a, to a football club that I've always known as a football league club, obviously with aspirations of getting back into the football league, but with the excitement and the opportunity to be a part of what could be a promotion, or at least a promotion challenge with the opportunity of a, a semi-final of the FA Trophy next week. Um, you know, it's exciting. It, it's something you can get your teeth into and, and gives you a buzz to get out of bed. So um, I'm grateful and I'm, I'm thankful for the opportunity. Um, I've kept myself in reasonable nick. I've not just sat around and, and ate and drank for the last six or seven months. Uh, I feel within a couple of days I'll be sharp and ready to hopefully contribute. And just finally, the manager like yourself is, is an experienced man. I know you've spoken to him briefly. What's he said to you about this opportunity? Um, come in and grab it, basically. It's, it's basically. Not a lot needs to be said with, as we say, been around long enough to know what it is. It's, um, I think obviously the, the club having a, a manager of, of that calibre to come here, I think it shows where they want to go. So um, now me and the manager have flirted probably for the last 10 years with various different clubs and, and things that we've never got, never quite got it over the line. So um, it was an easy conversation really. It's, um, it, it was a no brainer in the end.